I'll scan the target. has increased.
It has multiple... The enemy is down! Now's well your done. chance! Good choice! The enemy is down! Let us strike while the iron's hot! They can't miss! Great battle! My level of aptitude has increased. Strike while the iron's hot. You can't miss. Great battle.
It has multiple. I'll show you my true This thing won't give up. You won't escape. An unexpected turn on an enemy left. No shadows detected. My skill level has increased. Yes! My skill level has increased! Incredible! 
Oh. Another enemy down! Two left! You've improved. That's the way! Incredible! That's the way! Let us strike while the iron's hot! Can't miss! No shadows! Scan the target. This ends now! Akihiko Senpai might- I need your help! Three remaining. <laughs> Only two remain. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. One enemy left. One more to go. Fire it! It seems like it's weak against... I won't miss. I'm not who I used to be.
My level of aptitude has increased.
ordinary enemy. Don't let your guard down. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. I command thee! Such a... I just is in trouble! Hang in there!
One more to go. The enemy is getting stronger too.
Hey, you busy? Could you come with me for a sec? Let's go to the rooftop. Hey, we've really never had a chance to talk, have we? It's almost coming of age day, you know? I used to just think of it as a day off. But now, I wonder if I'm even gonna live long enough to celebrate it. It's been pretty weird around here lately. People have been passing out, others have gone missing. Dude, it's crazy. Senpai said it's because there are too many shadow victims and the memory revision can't keep up. It's all gotta be because of this Nyx. Oh, and have you heard about that doomsday cult? They've been running around town telling everyone they see that the end of the world is coming. Man, we need to do something. And quick. But it's not just Nyx, you know. Two members of Strega are still alive. They haven't done anything yet, but I know they've got to be planning something. And we need to take care of them, too. Wow. Becoming such good friends that I'd trust you with my life. <laughs> I never would have imagined that happening last spring. <laughs> but then again, I never thought it would come to this. You know, I don't think it's completely hit me yet. It's just all so hard to believe. But that doesn't mean we should just sit around and wait for it to happen. You're pretty cool, man. That thing was inside you for ten years, and you harnessed its power and made it your own. I'm glad I met you. It's embarrassing to say it, but, but that's really how I feel. We'll always be friends, right? I mean, even after this is all over? Cool. Where you spend your days? So, this is your room. I've never seen many of these things before. Regarding my request to visit your room, well, did it make you a little suspicious? I see. Actually, I do have something I'd like to talk to you about. During my forays into your world, I encountered many things. All of them are treasured memories, each one a polished glittering gem. Walking around the crowded Port Island streets, sampling the local cuisine, idling the hours away at the shrine, even attending your school for a day. That's when I came to a realization. 
I had subconsciously been requesting to visit places that were more and more central to your life. And so today, I requested to visit the one place in your world where I could learn the most about you. I requested to visit your room. If I may be so bold, Do you recall the day you gave me a tour of your school? How I mentioned that I felt very fulfilled when I touched you? It was the first time I ever felt that way. Why did I feel so fulfilled? After coming here, I can finally answer that question. I believe it's because I could feel what you feel and truly experience your life for the first time. We who reside in the Velvet Room wait with great anticipation for guests. Their arrival is our only link to the outside world and gives us a reason to be. By touching you like this, I can have that all for myself. I'll put it more plainly. I'm naive to the ways of your world, and there must have been many times I seem to act quite strangely. However, even I am not blind to the significance of calling upon a gentleman in his own room. If you wouldn't mind, I'd like you to guide me through it. Thank you. I feel like a completely different person than the Elizabeth who first stepped into your world. <sighs> if I stay on this side any longer, I fear I will forget my duties entirely. And that would put you at a severe disadvantage, wouldn't it? And that is why I'll draw a line under my visits here and remain on my side from now on. Thank you very much for acting as a guide on my journey of discovery. I'm very grateful. Now then, though the sorrow may be sweet, let us part.
Where have you been? <laughs> 